it's crazy. So today I would like to help a few people. If you're one of them people that are fat and you're tired of being fat because you're tired of waking up at night and going to the fridge for no reason and eating yourself to death. If you're tired of people thinking you're pregnant when you actually know, when you're still even a virgin, but just because you're fat, everyone thinks you're pregnant, then I'm going to help you today. I'm going to explain a few ways you can lose weight. There's nothing wrong with being fat, it's just that if that's not what you want out of life, same way there's nothing wrong from being skinny, but if that's not what you want, then there's something wrong with it. If you're tired of people making jokes about you, people calling you fat this, fat that, people calling you big titties, people calling you weird names man, like, you know, all the names they call fat people, then I'm going to help you, tell you how to lose weight. So the first way you can lose weight is to just stop eating man, like just chill out with the food, you know what I mean? Like if you wake up at night and you're starving, just stay in bed, breathing, then out. Do that until you calm down, okay? Every time you see food, tell that food to fuck off. Just do that to it. You know, I used to um, I used to get attracted to my boy's girlfriend. So if my boy got in a relationship with a girl, I would get attracted to them. And it became a habit, man, that like I could not help myself. So every time my boy or one of my boys got a girl, first thing that would come to my mind is like, wow, I can't wait to fuck her. Like, and it's my boy's girl. Like, you can't be thinking stuff like that. But then I started going like that. Every time I saw my boy's girl and the thought came in my head that, oh, imagine her naked. Imagine you smashing her and stuff. What I would imagine in my head would be like, fuck you, bitch. Fuck that girl. Fuck her. I'm better than her. Blah, blah, blah. That actually helps. It helps you hate something. And once you hate something, you stop. So stop, stop, just stop eating too much food. I'm just gonna say it straight. Cause there's nothing. There's no way you're gonna lose weight if you go to the gym for six hours and then you go home and you eat everything in your fridge. You know what I mean? Starve yourself. Starve yourself. Another way you can lose weight is to stop sucking dick. Like I know that sounds like something you didn't expect me to say, but actually research shows that most slugs are actually fat. 70% of the slugs are fat. The reason for this is because they suck so many dicks, man. Because if you suck so many dicks, dicks have protein. If you suck in dick, you gain protein. If that protein goes inside you, it's gonna make you fat. The reason I'm skinny is because I don't eat proteins, you know what I mean? So I have never eaten a protein in my life. I only eat like carbohydrates to keep me flexing, to keep me smashing all these girls, you know what I'm saying? To keep shagging all these girls, you know what I mean? But yeah, so just stay away from dick. Like if you're addicted to dick and you just can't live without it, every time you see a guy, just imagine that he's your dad. Then imagine him with your dad's face. If he's white, imagine if your dad was white, looking like that person that you want to suck his dick. Then after that, you start thinking that, oh, I'm not gonna shag him. He looks like my, my dad. And then stay away from dick. Dick is gonna make you fat. Another way to lose weight is to get out of a relationship, man. Relationships get girls fat like nothing. Every girl that I know that has put weight on, it's either a relationship, man. They get in a relationship, they settle down, suck dick every day, and then before you know it, you look like fucking the definition of fat. Like somewhere in the dictionary, they took out the definition of fat and they just put your name next to fatness and whatever. Yeah, so stay away from relationships. No one has ever lost weight in a relationship. It's a lie. If you see online, they're just lying to you. Everyone who leaves a relationship, that's when you lose weight. There's something about relationships that make people eat so much. I don't know if it's the stress or it's the whatever, but people just put weight on. Like, oh, my mates that used to have this skinny and nice looking, they get in a relationship. Oh my God, you don't even want to look at them the next day. They say they just get fat overnight. You know what I mean? So another way to avoid that is to stay away from relationships. Another way to lose weight is by not chilling with fat people. That's the truth of it. You're not gonna lose weight if you chill with fat people. Like if I start chilling with fat people, fam, the next year or something, you're gonna see me fat. I know that seems like impossible and I'm, you know, people always say you have high metabolism, whatever, which cuts your calories rapid and you can't put weight on, but that's a lie. If I start chilling with fat people, fam, my neck will boom. My stomach will come out and shit. So if you chill with fat people, man, it's hard because you're gonna see them and you're gonna feel relaxed and you're gonna feel like you're accepted and it's fine for you to be fat and that's not what you want. Maybe that's what they want. But if you don't want, if you want to lose weight, start chilling with skinny people. The more skinny people you chill with, the more you start to eat less. 
you might end up dying because you're used to eating a lot but it won't kill you it will kill you but at least you will die skinny and you'll be able to fit in whatever coffin they get you because imagine being so far and like the coffin they have to buy a coffin for two people i don't know if this is true that apparently if you're really fat on the plane um and you can't sit in one seat you have to buy two seats i don't know if that's true but i'm not here to make fat people jokes but if you want to lose weight get some skinny friends man look for all the skinny girls or if you're a girl look for them you know get in a leave that fat boyfriend of yours get in a relationship with a skinny guy yeah so do that and then before you know it, you will have no weight you'll be skinny you'll be flexing you'll be bouncing on dicks like you'll be so physically fit man you'll not be playing around you know what i mean but if you stay with these guys if you have a chubby boyfriend he doesn't shower, he just doesn't want to shower, not because he's fat, but he's allergic to soap and water for some reason. Yeah, if you still with that type of person, you're gonna end up becoming fat, you're gonna stink, you're gonna not brush your teeth, you're gonna lose the will to brush your teeth, you're gonna enjoy his and your stinky breath, you know what I mean? So, find yourself a skinny girl, a skinny boyfriend. Obviously, there's nothing wrong with fat people, there's nothing wrong with them if that's what they want, you know, there's nothing wrong with being skinny, if that's what you want. It's all about what you want. If you want a skinny guy, just text me. You know what I mean? I'll come hit you up, smash the shit out of you, and then maybe you lose weight. Like apparently, if you research shows that if you shag a skinny person, you could also lose weight. I don't know how that works, so maybe the sperm or some stuff like that. But it works, you know what I mean? Yeah, another way to lose weight is to stop chill with the implants, you know. Apparently something about implants makes people get fat. Like I don't have implants, I would like to have implants because I'm sick of getting all these girls pregnant It just pisses me off But yeah, if I had an implant, if I went out and got some implants um, I would never, if I was told to get an implant, I would never get one because I don't want to put weight on Like I could just tell a girl to have an abortion or wear five condoms You know, so yeah, so stay away from implants, they're gonna make you fat I don't know how that works because I'm not a girl I don't want to be a girl, but yeah, there's nothing wrong with being a girl. I just not my dream. Okay, so yeah um, That's how you can lose weight another way to lose weight is to stop chatting shit when you chat shit You kind of eat a lot, you know, have you realized that people who chat shit always eat so much shit, you know <laughs> So just don't chat shit. You'll be fine. You should be fine You know the biggest thing is to actually stay away from food. Just don't eat anything man Don't eat anything every time you're tempted just don't eat anything because everything else could work you know you could stop sucking dick you know stop being a slag you know you could stop chilling with skinny people you could stop chilling with fat people and chill with skinny people but if you do all this and you're still eating behind doors you're still hiding food and you should stop hiding food what is it with fat people with hiding food oh my god fat people love hiding food oh my god you gave in skinny people that like hiding food but fat people I used to have fat friends and these guys used to love to hide food like even if there's no reason to hide food they just hide even if there's no black guy around that's going to steal their food well I was the black guy around but they still hid it you know I even when I was in there the guy just used to hide his food so if you want to lose weight you have to stop hiding food when you hide food you're actually inviting food in your life okay don't take food to bed don't eat in bed if you eat in bed be a bedroom is supposed to be a resting place unless you're skinny like me me I can eat on the toilet I can eat anywhere make sure you eat on the table after you eat on the table do not eat again if you feel like you really need to eat something just have a wank wanks always calm down the pressure like do you ever feel so stressed you have a wank and you're fine I'm just saying so if you do this type of things you'll be fine eat when it's the right time to eat do a timer okay so eat about four hours between okay and don't pressure yourself you know if you can't lose weight within a week it's fine just make sure you lose a bit of weight at least after a month if you're not losing anything after a month fam you're fucked you're just gonna die fat they're gonna have to have six coffins joined together to make sure that you fit they will have to invent a car a special car to carry your dead body because you'll be too fat but I'm joking, that's not gonna happen. Just don't eat too much shit, man. Don't be like one of them fat people that think that because they eat healthy food, they should eat more of it. If you eat a lot of healthy food, you're still gonna get fat. If you decide to eat six 
cabbages or whatever or six lots of spinach or whatever you're still gonna get fat because it's a lot of food for your body to you know to control so you release the little muscles so after, you know you find some fat people that think that if they eat a lot of food as long as it's healthy they'll be fine the point is that the reason you're fat it's well because you're eating more food than your body needs so what happens is that it's going in inside you it's going inside and then it's making your instead of just helping you stay alive and keep you comfortable it's just making you get all these muscles or i mean all these stomachs or the tits like men with tits and stuff so yeah that's how you can lose weight i mean you can thank me later if you do all the things i just told you fun you lose weight in one day not one day I'm joking that will never happen maybe after 10 years I'm joking one year one year should do it if you do everything as you told okay but anyway yeah that was it for me I just feel like I need to help people lose weight like my exes are all far now because when I left them they had to stress you know they had to sit down and stress and they became slugs like they could they couldn't live without me so they just ended up eating the shit out of everything now they put weight on but now every once and then I message them and I give them a few tips of how they could lose weight and some of the tips I give them is I send them a few dick pics and I tell them to get back with me and I'll help them lose weight and once they get back with me because I'm skinny I give that to them so find a skinny guy again that's very important if you find yourself a skinny guy he will help you lose weight like if you get with me I'll help you lose weight but yeah that was it from today's video and I'll see you next time peace